Okay, let's read the Bible. This is Matthew 18. I'm going to read 14 through verse 20. Jesus heals a demon-possessed boy. At the foot of the mountain, a large crowd was waiting for them. A man came and knelt before Jesus and said, Lord, have mercy on my son. He has seizures and suffers terribly. He often falls into the fire or into the water. So I brought him to your disciples, but they couldn't heal him. Jesus said, you faithless and corrupt people, how long must I be with you? How long must I put up with you? Bring the boy here to me. Then Jesus rebuked the demon in the boy and, he, and it left him. From that moment, the boy was well. Afterwards, the disciple asked Jesus privately, why couldn't we cast out that demon? You don't have enough faith, Jesus told them. I tell you the truth. If you had faith even as small as a mustard seed, you could say to this mountain, move from here to there, and it would move. Nothing would be impossible. I think that's a lesson for us all. See, here the disciples, they traveled with Jesus every day, and they watched and they saw the things that he did. Think about it. Why wouldn't they have the faith if they watched the master do it? What are you doing with your faith? <laughs> Oh, God, this, uh, this word here, this is a blessing. What are you doing with your faith? What are you doing with what you've learned, what you saw, what you've witnessed in your life of what Jesus has done? Are you able to go forth and do the things that you witness him doing in your own life? Are you able to go forth and tell somebody, amen, speaking to somebody else's life, he giving you the same authority, amen, the same faith, amen, the same power to do as he has done. God bless you all.